Hello, I'm Samsai. And my name is Solar, Solar Pulse. And today we have something a bit different. Uh, we decided that because we have this, we, we both sort of own the channel here, we should probably play some games together, because so far we have mostly just played, you know, separate, completely separate games. So we decided because, well, our original plan was to play System Shock 2, but because I'm on Linux and the Linux version doesn't really work with the uh, multiplayer system, we kind of had to scrap that, but luckily we have Civilization 5 here. So this is going to be our... Well, I guess we're, we're probably going to spend our whole day with this. Yeah, like, I mean, what was the last game we played long ago? Uh, like eight, 8 hours, I think. Yeah, it was something like, like 8 hours. <laughs> it's going to be interesting to see how long we can last. Uh, so we're going to play this basically in co-op, so we are not going to go against each other. So we're probably just going to play against the AI. We have four AI players here. And this is a fairly regular old setup. We of course have all the DLC enabled. All of it. So I guess we should just pick our uh, leaders then. Or should we go random? We could go random. Yeah, let's... sure, let's go completely random. Shall we play on, uh, normal difficulty? Um, I guess. I mean, I'm not the greatest player and it's been a long while since I last played. I could knock it down to Warlord. And that would be too easy, probably. I mean, Prince isn't that hard to begin with. Yeah, l sure, let's go with, uh, Prince. I guess, uh... Okay, yeah, I guess this is everything. So let's uh, save the game and start start it up, I guess. Uh, wait, how does one do that, by the way? Oh, I need to ready my status. Right. <laughs> 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 I, was, I was going to save the game configuration. It's been a while since I played this game, and I haven't hosted like a single game. Oh, I'm playing as the Dutch Empire. I think I'm Napoleon. <laughs> so, uh, it seems I am like going to be uh, like trade oriented, I guess. So it's going to be interesting to see how this goes. And uh, yeah, we are we're on the same side. We're on team one. So, oh, what did I do? How can one play this game again? I guess I should probably explore and then set up my cities. Um, I probably have pretty okay place. Just set set it up right here. And I guess let's just do that. Yeah, that that looks like a nice place. Trade might be a bit problematic. I'm sort of thinking about settling to the coast. So what should we research? Um, if you're going to go trading, I guess pottery should be the first one. Probably, yeah. I mean, I think we should probably focus... Uh, what's the... How do you play France anyway? I have no idea. I have never played them. I have never played them either, so... <laughs> I guess we'll see. I guess they are sort of military oriented, but they always surrender or something. <laughs> 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 okay. Um, I mean, I could just um, go like aggroing everyone and then begging for forgiveness. I guess that would be interesting. Uh, there is like, there are no good places here, but I guess I'm going to have to settle somewhere, otherwise I'm just going to waste my time. I, have I actually probably should have moved the city a bit south, so I would have been on the coast, but what's done is done. Okay, I'm going to found Amsterdam here. I guess that makes sort of... Uh, uh, it makes sense, because Amsterdam is sort of like... I don't know. Isn't it on the, like, the coast? I don't know. Uh, I... Yeah, I'm probably going to go 
pottery as well. And uh, I need a scout. Actually, I should build a scout too, but I'm already going monument. Let's be the noob. Here's a. Yeah. Okay, um, I think I found. I found Mount Fuji, so. Happiness, awesome. And I think there's like a city state right next to me. I think I'm going to kill them immediately. Or you should could just steal their units and. Well, that's also an option. So do I do I want to like build a relationship with them, or do I just want to ruin their day? I mean, city states never actually attack you, so you can just steal their units and wait for a few turns, and then like back for forgiveness. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. It's so close to me, though. Mm. I guess for 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 the moment, I think I'm just going to play the good guy and like do trading with them. But after I'm a bit bigger, I'm just going to murder murder all of them because that's the way I feel. I'm going to play this game. And uh, I mean, you're on the coast. They should probably just rush sail sailing, I guess. Yeah, uh, sailing is probably a good thing to go for. We kind of need to, if we want to play together effectively, we need to somehow connect our empires. I have some cattle here and some stone. I think I'm, those are probably going to be useful at some point. I oh, I found Catman too. Nice. It seems we both settled right next to city-states. And... Uh, oh yeah, I can find a pantheon. Me too. Uh, do, 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 do. Who do I want to worship? Uh, nope, nope. I guess I could go just fertility rights, and that way I would grow a bit faster. I don't, th I don't really have anything else here. Mm. That's actually a good question. What should I pick? I'm just going to go fertility. I think I'll just go for messenger of gods. I mean, I don't have any city connections yet, but. Uh, I guess I should go for animal husbandry because there's uh, there are some uh, cows right next to me. And yeah, that uh, might be a good idea then. And I need oh. workers. And now I have my scout, so I could send him to explore everywhere. It seems we have. No, actually we... Well, we are doing fairly okay on the <laughs> scoreboard, so not really. We are actually the two... <laughs> We're on the bottom of the... The scoreboard. Guess... Uh, well, bots usually play, play pretty optimally, so... They sometimes do, yes. E uh, except when they go into war, because that's when they screw up. Well, it might be like... Um, designed that way so the human players have a chance because if the AI would be perfect then human players would never have a chance to be eating them. Mm, possible. Okay, I've found plenty of ruins. So I'm just going to have to get all of that stuff and I will be golden. It seems this continent isn't all that big. It might be a bit bigger in the like the southern area, but it looks like this won't be a huge continent. And I'm actually in the like the top of it, where it's not even all that great to be. Mm, what was the best uh, policy or? Well, policy 3 to expand, wasn't it liberty? Depends 
on what you are going to do. Uh, I guess liberty is good because you are probably going to go for a bigger uh, empire. Some early honor might be good as well because you will get all the bonuses from killing the barbarians. PT never never really works, so I guess um, unless you go for religion. Yeah, but who goes for religion? It's either honor, liberty, or tradition. I think I'll take liberty for now. Mm. Yeah, I I think I need to think about early expansion. Because there are some really good areas here that I would like to uh, expand into. You have a pretty nice place going there. Mm. Okay, so I found some barbarians. So well, that's good. Okay, I got some survivors and I think there's... Uh, Okay, that's yellow. I th could that be yet another... Actually, I'm not sure. That might be just uh, another city-state or something. Yeah, it should be city-state because it's yellow and black. Yeah. If it was a player, it would be... Actually, I should probably go color. there. Because I will get that. Yeah, it's Valletta. So that means I get, I get some money because I... Actually, I wasn't the first here. Indonesians are here first. So, okay. I don't think there is much I can do right now. Oh, I've met some Inca warriors and uh, Bruges. Okay. Well, barbarians, but... Oh, I forgot about the barbarian brute here. I think I'm going to be okay. Hmm. I will get the animal husbandry in two turns, and I will get my worker in four. Actually, I, th I think I should probably go do some citizen management. Increase the production just slightly. I don't think it matters at this point because there is, like, there are no improvements on the surrounding tiles anyway. Well, at least for me, it didn't really matter. I checked it out, and best I could do is like um, lose food production and gain like one production. Mm. Okay, so fighting against these brutes is basically worthless because I I don't have like uh, I don't have honor, so my combat effectiveness isn't all that great. I guess I should just uh, continue exploring because that's the only thing I can really do. Oh, I got some archers. That's really good. I guess I'm actually going to go for the encampment because I have archers and those are just awesome. Some barbarians tried attacking me last turn but now they backed off. Yeah they usually do something like that. Okay so should I... I, I totally should go for sailing. Uh, should I attack? I can do more damage if I attack these guys. Uh, maybe I should go... Nah, I'm just going to attack these guys. And I cannot do anything with those. Um, where's my... Oh, uh, no, there's my scout. I was wondering where it went, but... It didn't really go anywhere. Hmm. Okay, so uh, I can I can do more damage here. Guess I'm just going to fight against these barbarians for a while. See how that goes. And I have gained sailing. 
next stop, I guess, uh, maybe mining. I don't think I have anything. Um, I'm going for archery. I I have very little mountains and well hills here, so uh, don't really like that. I guess I could go for riding, but honestly, I think I need mining more later on. Okay, and my worker is going to be done. And let's just kill those guys. And apparently you met Ormas. Um, yeah, apparently I did. Hmm. And my scout just decided to run on their soil, so they will probably be pretty mad at me soon enough. Hmm, I guess I could... Or should I go for... Uh... I think I need granary more. More growth. And you just build improvements. I don't really care to micromanage that uh, worker. I could care yeah, less. Yeah, I, I had my scout to just explore. Yeah, I did that too. I don't care to... I, I don't care about micromanagement a whole lot. Okay, barbarians are just messing with me right now. Uh, heal... Just go there and do some of your magic. Minor victory is okay. And I'm just going to start to destroy these random barbarians that are approaching Amsterdam. Oh, I already did that. Now should we start naming our cities soon enough? Maybe we should. Maybe we should. What should be the naming... Uh, like policy here? I have no idea. Last time we did that, um, game city names. Mm. Haha, <laughs> barbarian encampment destroyed. Should I also go for a liberty? Uh, actually, I'm going to go for honor because it seems I'm seeing so many uh, just barbarians around here. I just want to kill all of them. We could go for game cities again. Because I, I can't think of like any other naming scheme. That's an option. Um. Die you stupid barbarians. And why are you stupid barbarians harassing my uh, soon to be <laughs> renamed city of Amsterdam? Masonry. Should I? Possibly. I guess I'm just going to go for archery. I think it's a bit more valuable at the moment. Yeah, archery should be done soon enough. Okay, this barbarian should die really soon. Okay. Hmm. Guess I hmm. should start moving this back, honestly. I'm going to move the archers back to defend our lands. And my warrior can just move I around. I think I should go for the wheel. I mean, it pr it's probably good if you go get some roads going as soon as possible. Mm, the wheel is probably good. Did I actually... Mm, yes, I did. Okay, good. I thought I messed up. <laughs> My caravan will be done in four turns. So, 
yeah, you can do trading with Kathmandu or... I think Ormus is a bit too far away. Yeah, and I'm pretty sure they're mad at me, so I'm going to probably do it with Kathmandu. Mm. And besides, there's like some um, barbarians roaming around between Ormus and me. Well, Ormus and Barry, so... Yeah, I might do some trading with Samarkand, because I feel like they might be our... Uh, uh, an ally worth it, but I, I'm not sure. Okay, and I found... I think I found my first, like, real civilization. So the, these are the Indonesians. Where's my... I was supposed to have an explorer around here, but I have no idea where they went. <laughs> I mean, that's my warrior and that's my... They're archer. pretty good at hiding, sometimes. <laughs> yeah. Don't hide from your king. I'm going to get pissed. Well, I guess if they just either died or left my whole continent somehow. Uh, monuments or maybe a trireme. Maybe they learned how to fly. I'm going to build a trireme just to explore. Yeah, maybe my explorers learn, learn to fly somehow. I mean, I'm pretty sure they're in on different continents. It seems like highly likely at this point. Uh, I think it's... yeah, I think that's the case. I bet there's like a huge ocean between us. On both sides. Mm, I guess I'm just going to attack them. And I'm also going to march right into the Indonesian area. Because I, I need to know how big their civilization is, because we're probably going to take them on. Oh, I get a free worker, that's good. <laughs> um... I was probably just... Actually, I shouldn't try to build a road yet, because that's going to cost pretty much. It's going to be expensive. Yeah, it's going to be a bit expensive to do it right now. Wow, this area is... If that weren't a desert plot, I'd probably put a city right there. But because it is, I don't really care. Maybe around here? That would have been a better starting position, I think. So many, like, gems and stone. Even cotton. I think I sometimes overestimate the value of, like, uh, oceans and stuff like that, and that makes me just very hesitant to build on, like, the inland plots. What are you actually um, researching? Uh, I just finished the wheel, so I guess that means I'm probably going to go for like uh, masonry. Or actually riding is probably a bit better. Uh, walls mm. and quarries. I don't think that need uh, that, yeah, that needs masonry actually. Mm, I'm probably going to go for masonry. Yeah, I think I'll go for masonry too. There's a bit of stone that I would like to get. It seems you already have your farms and all. My guys are still working on my farms. Yeah, I have my farms there. Going pretty well, I mean, now that I have two workers, they will probably just 
rush and give me tons of farms. Okay, I killed yet another brute. And oh yeah, I need to move my warriors around. Okay, yeah, I found your carta. So did you go for ho honor? Yeah, I went for honor. All right. Um, I'm going to be the warrior warrior race. <laughs> The tribe of warriors here. Yeah, I don't think I I can do much on this turn other than destroy some barbarians and explore just a bit more. Should best my warriors. I'm kind of there. Okay. And mm. a great general. I think I'm going to take that. Great gener general, this early. Yeah, because I'm going for like complete honor. I'm probably That's going to have to uh, take some liberty and all kinds of that stuff from like another tree. I can't go like pure. That's pretty interesting having a great general this early. <laughs> yeah, it's it's weird, but I I think I might find a use for that. I am going to build a... wait... Can I actually do that? Yes, I can build a citadel right here, somewhere. Oh, are you going to name your city, city 17? Yes, actually, that's not a bad idea. I think I'm going to, I'm going to move my guy over here and I'm going to build a citadel here. <laughs> um. That's all right, but what I, what I would have done is wait for your city to expand one more and just... I don't care. Just then I don't care. I want it right next to the city, because that's that's canon. <laughs> Honestly, building citadel citadels this early is it's not even worth it, but... Um, I mean, it's totally worth it for the name. <laughs> yeah, it's totally worth it for the name. So actually, l let me rename this city if I can figure out how. Uh, edit. So this is going to be City 17. Welcome all of my workers. Actually, the funniest part, I probably don't need to rename any city because I can just pretend that this is the city from Assassin's Creed Unity. <laughs> yeah, uh, totally, totally. Yeah, I think that's a solid explanation. Yeah, I think I'm going to rename it when I... Um, Come up with a good name. Yeah. I mean, I I have some options, um, ideas already, but they're not that good. So. Uh, what, what uh, city could that be? Oh, that's Milan. I appreciate your free money. And my trireme is nearly ready, as well as my masonry. We're actually doing rather well. But I'm definitely going to have to expand soon. Okay... And what shall be next? Um, writing could be pretty good. Yeah, I think writing, writing is probably, it makes sense. Work boats, I don't think I have any fishies here. Mm. Walls, not worth it. Maybe monuments or possibly a settler. Yeah, I'm actually going to go for another city. I think that's uh, a good move, maybe. And I think you are supposed to go away from that place, because that's just a dead end. The Trireme can do all the exploring. <laughs> oh, there's some proper barbarian action going on here. Oh, is it? Oh, indeed. Yeah. Indeed, you're getting attacked. 
And there's, yeah, there's a barbarian uh, encampment right here. And some brutes. You'll probably be able to handle that. I should be fine. I'm going on the de on the defensive because I'm trying to build the Temple of Artemis. Oh, you're going for wonders? Yeah. Interesting. Yeah, Samarkand doesn't really like me a whole lot because I'm just I just keep walking through their territory. Well, in this case, sailing through their territory, but same difference, I guess.